One of the most common applications for smart devices is adding voice control to environmental home controls that affect the temperature, humidity, and air of the home. There are several basic device types for comfort and control interactions, including air purifiers, fans, radiators, thermostats, and more. Depending on the specific features and controls available on the device you're building, these are some of the recommended device traits you should implement. Comfort and control devices have important latency and reliability metrics to hit in order to pass certification. You can monitor these metrics through the Google Home Analytics dashboards to ensure your devices are functioning properly. When enabling voice control for features like temperature or humidity settings, adding secondary user verification to your fulfillment will ensure Google Assistant understands the user's request and changes the smart device settings to exactly what the user wants. There are several code labs that will walk you through implementing the appropriate traits for your device, monitoring the reliability and latency, and more. Check out the Developer Center for these resources to get started developing comfort and control devices. Thanks for watching.